Sorry, David, I, was, I had a really good intro planned. I don't know whether I should talk about it, but basically, I ran out of time. Um, I could throw it up, but it's just not ready yet. I haven't even done really a warm up. Oh, I've got to get myself sorted out. Heart rate, wahoo, power meter. Make sure it's the right one. Yeah. Asiomas. Asiomas. Okay. Just my heart rate's high, just from the stress. Don't want to press and ride. Press start on here. Okay, is everything working all right? Maybe the microphone's a bit loud. No, I don't think it's just the. Should be alright. Yeah, I had, a, I had a really good idea for an intro explaining what, we're, what this actually is. Yeah, I got my. It's not very straight, is it? <laughs> Thanks, David. How come you're here? I thought you weren't going to be here. And what have we got? 54 seconds to go. Jesus. Alrighty. Uh, so my intro is going to be explaining what Zwift is actually about and what this course is. So it's going to be five, five laps of the fan flat, and then we head off down to the uh, Libby Hill. So. I'm not sure what I'm going to do. Maybe I'll go, well, I was going to go hard at the start to try and drop people, but I'm not warmed up. My heart rate's crazy. Radio. And so I'm first in the championship at the moment after three rounds. We've got, it's an eight round, eight round championship. All right, time to turn the industrial fan on. Come on, people, chase. Dean. I want to drop those unsuspecting riders already. up and we'll go hard up the hill again Yeah, I want to try and make it hard to lead because once you're on the flats, not much you can do.
Couldn't break them. <sighs> How's the sound with the fan? Too hot, too loud? Great. I can turn it down if it'll be better. Who's giving all those thumbs up? Go try and adjust this thing. Um, tried to organise another view for you, the rear view camera. But just ran out of time. the um, Aussie hunt day ride on Wednesday night with oh, okay, my breath back. with Daz Carter I messaged him during the ride because it's sister group ride where you did two laps or well, we did two laps of the what's it called anyway it's basically around under the tunnels up to the volcano through the volcano and back to the beach side and you do two laps of that steady pace with the beacon and then it's an after party so I messaged Daz and said let's go hard on that little kicker outside the volcano Actually got in a move before that it was a guy with Z Power and another guy who's a national, I think it's a mountain bike rider in a national team here in Australia. So I made the jump before it got too big and then it sat on them hoping that Daz would come across, which he did. 
on that kicker before you hit the Italian village. I think he bridged across like five or six seconds, maybe more. So I sat up and tried to give him a smaller gap. Hey Michael, welcome to the channel. So I was actually going to show a little bit of that that race. If this one gets a bit boring in a few laps, as I'm riding on this one of course. But it was really good because Daz and I attacked and then one other rider came with us. He's, he was that national rider. Yeah, Dave, it's hard. Man, I tried working with Daz to try and beat that rider. But he kicked away as, just as we are going into the beach side. As you go over that go through that tunnel, not really a tunnel, but a bridge over the water, go right a little tiny hill and then turn, descend left into the main beach. He kicked away from us there. I was in lead wheel when he went past and I was hoping Daz would chase him down and I could carry right his wheel. But Daz and I had nothing left. I'd saved my feather so I popped that as we were descending along the beach but we just couldn't catch what's happened to Michael what have you done to yourself Michael too much <laughs> I'll turn it down a little bit probably really loud saying aerodynamics counts even on a line stream. I'll try RTX. better should be better probably the RTX changes makes my voice sound different not as natural but at least it cuts down the fan noise make it louder again so swift background noise too loud <laughs> it is a pleasure to ride when you're live streaming and worrying about everything.
starting to recover after that beginning effort. Don't think it paid off at all. Michael Swift has really helped my riding because I can just get on yeah David it's I like it because it passes the time um, but it'll be so good if you could just turn the Swift on and go and still be a live streaming I'll live stream tomorrow's two hour race. Um, just because if we do make under two hours, it'd be great to have it on recording. I think we should make it if all the riders who have signed up turn up so far. When I did that specialized run for ride, I know I was constantly in the draft, which is different to what we'll have. Got up some speed here. This guy's getting dropped. I know I'll, um, I was doing 57 kilometers an hour average, including that little kicker. So, oh, Michael, I put it on. Tomorrow's stream. We'll watch him for a little bit. Um, yeah, I got just 57 kilometers an hour at 4.7 watts per kilo. So surely, surely we can do 50. If people keep rolling at the front, 4.2. So, um, Sarah from the Pros Closet event, we're going to try and, well not we, they, without help, are going to try and do 100 kilometers in sub two hours. If I go flat. No one's done it before. Check the last event. Now three minutes thirty off. My plan, David, is just to sit in the wheels for the first twenty minutes, not make any efforts. Let the guys who are only going to do fifty kilometres. Push hard at the start. Soon they're going to do, they're going to have people who do short, sharp efforts. It's a smart thing to do. <laughs> I'm only making an effort, David, if, 
gonna make a difference. Yep, Michael, that's it. On well, my Sunday night at eight o'clock, I think it's your midday, whether midday or 10 a.m. I know they're trying to recruit as many rides as possible, so I'm really hoping the aero guys turn up. But they've got an NRS race tomorrow in the morning. So they might not be interested. They might want to organise their own attack at sub one hour mark. The aero guys are the fastest TT guys on the lift. One of their slower riders came 11th, I think of the last four or five national championships. I'm not sure what the other riders came in the national championships because maybe it's faster than outdoors, but indoors there's some fast guys. Well, they're fast outdoors too. They're all NRS, like national road series riders. Yeah, Nick Velo Kicks is the guy. So Phil's doing a live stream in what, just over 20 minutes. What time does his race start? How many minutes? Alright, so 24 minutes time. Hopefully I get the race done before then. Oh, 34 minutes. Yeah, 34 minutes. So, my plan was to go hard at the start and see if I'd show anyone. That's not happened. Pretty much just sit in now. I'm not sure if I should attack before the descent. See if we can get rid of those light riders on the descent. That's like plenty of time. It's going to sit there for. Well, I assume you won't go live. 10 to 9, surely. 25 minutes of sitting there. <laughs> I don't want to say too much about Phil considering my live streaming performance today, but <laughs> it does make me feel better, feel better about how hard this is. Especially considering how long he's been doing it for. What's the problem with this format? So, I'm going to bring the mic down a bit closer. Is that better? Yeah. Yes, but he gets the views. I need to fall off my bike or something. See, my microphone's in here.
I think the fact that he just tries so hard every race is <laughs> I think wow. But he's always so disappointed in himself. And he shouldn't be. He is at the top level of lift. It's just a problem with lift. Is the higher you get, the more it's always something faster than you. so deep. Last week's race where he got dropped and chased back on. Well, I definitely would have given up. So I knew that there was no chance once I was back on. The race was over. Yep. He and Ed. I don't think Pritchard is such a gent, but He's also funny. <laughs> I've been actually missing Cotton Hunt TV's Swift Racing. Oh, anyway, let's fly <laughs> I don't even know if this is the last lap till we go to the hill. There's a big shirt guy. I think you might have made the segment too hard, David. I think Fritch is going to be out of it. Come on. Bit terrible in real life. Crip racing outside. I've got no idea how many laps that was. Okay, so my next tactics. This is like, I think it's one more lap. Then. As we go through the, the banner, the fourth and the step. Yeah, but I think Preacher was pretty fit back then. He's lost a little bit of fitness. But I'm like, trying to get more views. Made that hilarious video. <laughs> Being the goalkeeper, the cycling goalkeeper. <laughs> that was one of his funniest videos yet. I don't even watch the cycling goalkeeper, but it feels like I have. Then he hurt himself on the football field. Yeah. 
Only three seconds. Zone two, right, one second. Right, here we go. Left, left. Yeah. So I was thinking about the bike to use on Libby Hill. From the testing I did on Box Hill, the uh, Canyon Aero 2021 with the Swiss wheel, that climbs faster than the, the Tron. And it almost is Aero. But not enough to think. So I went with the Tron. Definitely not the vent of the disc. Sure exactly, but it's around. Seems like it's around six seconds slower on Box Hill, which isn't much. It's really hill. It's gonna be tense in it. But drop the tail. All right. Just lift right off the front again. So the guy's in second place in this series. A bit of a beast. He used to be a track and field runner for his country. Definitely vented this tomorrow though. Here's your date, here's the safety bike. Mind you, I want to do a test with the safety bike. It's weird. Because with my testing, I found the frames don't make much difference at all. For wheels. I didn't have the Tron. I wouldn't use the vents for this course. I used the outer ride. Because of the, because of the Libby here. And also, the other interesting thing was with the lightweight wheels and the Tarmac Pro. They keep getting stuck in the draft. Getting sticky draft. So I'm not sure if it's just that that occurrence. They kept bumping into the rider ahead. I couldn't pass. Despite probably well definitely on that steep section it'll be faster. But the other more aero setup seemed to glide through the rider with no problem. Okay, I've been going for just over 30 minutes. At least 25 k's. Not late in. I'm not more than 
Yeah, he always finds that, but he never rides. He just finds that so people see that he's doing it in this life as well. Here's the click fader of Zwift. Well, of the Zwift developed so. Since I developed so. You know what I mean. What any locusts in the chat? I haven't been telling my family too much about my live streaming because it's just a bit of mucking about. I know they'll be bored. Shitless watching. Then my mum went and told everyone she knows, I think. So I got there. As soon as she told everyone she knows, I think I'd like 10 months of the Um So there may be, maybe looking at this, I'm wondering what the hell's going on. Okay, thanks David. That guy in the black flip set up front again. Yeah, this is much better than that chase race I did. York. Much more of my stuff sitting in the wheel. Being pulled to the line. Right, here we go. So when we get this banner, I'll try and time it so I shoot off the front down the hip. Try and drag the heavy riders with me. See if we can catch some of the light riders out. At least make it pedal down the hill. So we go to the banner in that right hand turn. So after that right hand turn. I don't want to kick away too far though, because that just let me go. Let me kick past me. Hello. Thank <laughs> you. 
I shield a few on it. So I keep that momentum up. Guys, I'm not coming back. Rest up. The way the point structure works, it's like the hour up. Get an extra five points. First and second and third. Downwards is just one point different. So I'm going to get a second, it's a big boost. Maybe it's, actually, I'll write it down. I even had it all talked about. So it's 640 meters long, 7% average. I got that 50, 50 second hour on my third. Oh, didn't climb up. It's about a minute and nine seconds. I'm going to set to start. I need to lock now. Gotta be at the front, there's a little bump. What is momentum? Oh. It's a time route.
Ah, oh, held under first. Held under first in the series. Actually, I think the guy that's second already signed up. Or he was signed up. So this should be a good lead for me now. Still in the power. Go to check. Darren Lewis will be with us. All right, David. All right. Bloody graph. Yeah. yeah. That was the same as last week, David. The guy that beat me, both the guys. I think one was 50, one was 52. That's why I was trying to attack for the descent. See if we can drop it. There's no way you can beat on at 50, 50 kilos. <laughs> Someone messages, I can't even get a 23 through after that. Oh yes, hey man. Let me see. Good power and check out. The only one that finished ahead of me. That's contention. So Michael Horan's third point. <laughs> Cock hands in fourth. I actually hit that a lot. So I'm in first place. Doesn't have the points, but it shows me in oh, ice. You get it all wrong. Okay. So, uh, Paolo is. 18 points behind me, so he might. It's 25 points to win, 20, 15, 16. I uh, should be able to still be in front. <laughs> oh, I'll be up, guys. I'll be the warm up now. See what's going on. So, so much. Good.
I feel like I'm in a gyro. Impressive, yep. I can't even get my jersey on. Imagine if it's a, a wet jacket. Must be an Aussie thing. Can't get out of wet weather jackets on. Thanks, Lee. Thanks, David. They yeah, come and join. Have a look at that. Check how we're going through the day. Hopefully, we finish in less than two hours. Okay. Ask him if we're doing a difficult the two hour ride tomorrow. Probably don't need it. Be a hundred miles. It's so annoying. Okay, I'll end this ride and see what Zert says. I'll create a wind for Zert. Okay, so I lined up there. Okay. I'll back to that now. So, pretty much bang on my signature. I wasn't even sure it's the breakthrough because I hit dog directly on my what I was predicting. That was the metrics. So focus duration there is four minutes thirty one. So it's basically a breakaway specialist, as it said, which is not surprising. So it's about 374 points of pressure. I don't want that messing up the metrics for when I say to it. But yeah, it's all, it's all over the Phil's channel. Say hello to him. Thanks for watching, everyone. We'll see you tomorrow for the two, hour, <laughs> two hours of fame.